Hello YouTube. Today will be the last um, episode of this series in which I open a pack I have been saving for a while. Uh, some quick updates. I have, uh, if I, I don't remember, if I said in the last episode, um, at, uh, I have decided what I will be doing for prizes. I will be doing um, a free prize giveaway that includes uh, free shipping. Um, every 50 subscribers, at uh, 10,000 subscribers, I will be uh, sending this to one lucky subscriber. The Charizard EX 20th Anniversary Red and Blue Collection Box. This is this is uh, actually the last box in my, uh, or around uh, any town in my area, as these have become extremely popular because it's 20 years and the cards are sick. They're amazing. Look at it. Get one of. Each pack there, very nice. Uh, this is said to skyrocket next year and go up every year after. So, 10,000 subscribers, one lucky fan will win this wonderful box. So, uh, please don't forget to subscribe, like if you like what you see. I'm going to try um, music for the background. Um, Tonight is uh, Shine Down, um, one of my all-time favorite bands, um, and it looks like oh no, the next one will not be Shine Down. Next one will be Stained. It's been a while. Um, tonight, it's all about this right here. I want this Pokemon from this pack. I've been a uh, Looking through uh, the uh, packs I've opened for you guys, and I've noticed that there have been no, not really any foils, any good foils. So I, ha I suspect that uh, someone has been weighing the packs. Um, tell me what you think about people who weigh the packs. Personally, I'm against it because it makes it unfair for everybody. Um, you know, because they get the rares and then, you know, no one else has a chance to even get, you know, the, the EXs or the special full art promos. Um, I, I just, I don't agree with it. Uh, if you uh, agree with uh, full art, art with uh, people who buy packs after they weigh them because they guaranteed us something good in it, um, let me know in the comments. If you disagree, let me know in the comments. Uh, so let's get to this right now. That's the front. Luxray break, I believe they call it. That's the front, that's the back. Now I've had a problem with codes. Um, I want to save this artwork. Do I have a knife? Of course I don't have a knife. I'll just have to be very careful because I like I want this or how the heck do they do this? Well, that's weird. Ah, I can open it from the bottom. Um, my friend who I've been giving the codes to says that the codes from these packs have not been working on the games. Um, I'm not sure what's going on with that. Um, I'm going to look into it. If I need to, I will contact Pokemon. See what's going on because you know that's part of the reason people buy packs is to get the codes for the games. Um, and you know, I I want to give uh, the codes to my friend, but he says that they're not working, so I don't know what's going on with that. Uh, if you know, let me know. He says that the codes aren't long enough, uh, and they go an interval of three, four. Three, three. Um, so I don't, I don't know what's going on with that. I, I, I don't really use codes. I've been saving them for a while. Uh, 
So let me know what's going on with that. Um, all right. Ooh, cool. The pack inside. Red Gyarados, which is shiny Gyarados. That's the front. That's the back. That's cool. I might make a, a one of a kind item out of that. I'll have my friend right here that he does it. Not my uh, friend that I give the codes to, but uh, another friend. He does a uh, special one of a kind if you uh, get it to him artwork using these uh, packs here. There we go. This one, this new code is 3433 as well. That's not the number of the code. It goes three um, either numbers or letters, four, and then, you know, you get the idea. All right, so let's open this. Let's uh, see what we get. Hopefully I get something good because if uh, this is another, uh, you know, non-foil pack, I mean, someone's weighing them, and I might want to talk to Walmart about that because that's where I buy uh, a lot of my packs. Um, I also have a shop in my hometown where I buy packs as well. The packs in my hometown are a lot cheaper. Um, Walmart charges like a dollar more. Um, so I'm going to give a quick shout out to Greenfield Games, Greenfield, Massachusetts. And that's a um, great family fun place. Uh, table, anything tabletop games. They don't do video games, but tabletop games, card games, stuff like that. They're a great place. I highly suggest them. All right, so let's get started. First card, Shelter. He's sticking his tongue out at you. Throw a rock at him or something. Teach him a lesson. Uh, ooh, ooh, I like that. That's Blitzel. I like that. Next card is a forest seed. He was annoying in, uh, I forget what it was, but you could choose one of the three basic starters uh, and uh, just fight and go around and train. And you could headbutt this guy and he wouldn't move. It's like all the other guys would like fight you. He'd just sit there and do nothing. <laughs> but he's an interesting one. Ooh, Electro Buzz. Not very strong for an Electro Buzz, but Electro Buzz, never, nevertheless. A Pneumo. Wow, that's a strong Pneumo. Oh, a reverse. Oh, okay, there we go. What the heck is this? A reverse foil rare, and it's Trev Trevenant. Trevenant, it's like a tree with claws. Weird as heck. Weird, I tell you. Sorry, guys, I've got to do the card trick. But let's see what else we get. Uh, of just a basic rare Greninja. 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 Like another frog guy. Kind of interesting. Next is. Ooh. Gabbit. Interesting. Not a very strong one. Next is. All Night Party. There's a nice little espion in the picture. That's a good one. Oh wow. There's a bunch of them in the picture. That's a nice one right there. And the final card. Psychic's Third Eye. Alright. So I don't know. I have a feeling someone's been weighing the packs. So I'm going to... Um, because... Oh, crud, I dropped them. I'll pick them up after. 
because uh, just a basic reverse foil, that's what I've been getting. You know, I bought a bunch of packs, and you would expect that I get, you know, at least one break card or full foil card or full art card, something other than what I'm getting. So I will go and make a complaint with Walmart um, because I, I, it's just not fair. Uh, people go in, they weigh the cards, they take all the good ones, and then no one else has a chance to get it. Um, I know there are some YouTubers who, you know, have a channel about that. I'm not, you know, attacking you or, or anything like that. I just do not agree with that. Um, so yes, this will be the uh, last of the pack opening series from the newer sets. Um, and I will start doing uh, an older set display kind of uh, show. I will be going back from the early sets, uh, showing you what each card looked like um, from each specific set, if I have it. Um, no, it's softly windy out. But yeah, let me know what you think of the music. Don't forget, uh, at ev every 50 subscribers, I will do one free, excuse me, free prize giveaway. One lucky fan will get a special, um, we'll say if, uh, at 50 subscribers, one fan will get a sealed pack. And I will buy them from, uh, I will not buy them from Walmart. Um, uh, pause that for a minute. If I can. Yes, thank you, Volkswagen. I don't care. Yes, that's nice. I don't care about that. So yeah, I will get them at the uh, shop where they do not allow people to weigh the packs. Um, so you are at least guaranteed to get or you are you have a lot better chances to get something good, whereas um, someone apparently weighs the stuff at this Walmart. Um, let me know what you thought about the music in the background. Um, do you like it? Let me know. Uh, like, subscribe. Um, don't forget to check out my last video where I gave a shout out. Um, and opened a pack. Again, this will be the last episode of the pack opening series. Um, so yeah, let me know. And um, yeah, keep an eye out for my next episode. Um, I will probably call it I think this is like my eighth episode. I'll call it a uh, season two. Um, Only Kitsune season two Pokemon. Some you know something. Keep an eye out, and uh, I'll see you next time. All right. Oh, gotta go and back into the camera. See you later, YouTube. Oh, I almost forgot. Check out my um, Only Kitsune sales channel. As well, uh, my video game channel is down, but I might be able to get it back up very soon so I can show you all some video games, which I used to be really good at, but apparently I am pretty bad. <laughs> uh, all right, uh, and I will see you next time. See you later, YouTube.